Hi, today I want to introduce present tense in Ukrainian. Unlike in English, in Ukrainian present tense covers both present continuous and present indefinite tenses. Infinitive of present tense is usually uh, the ending T. Now, let's move on to verbs themselves. First one is dumate, meaning think, to think, dumate. Second one is znate, meaning to know, znate. Third one is mate, meaning to have, mate. The fourth one is rozmovlyate, meaning to speak or to talk. Rozmovlyate. Now let's conjugate them. To conjugate them, I will take only two pronouns. First one is actually the most uh, oftenly used is I, yeah. And the second will be familiar you, T, T. Let's conjugate these verbs. Ja rozmovlyayu. I talk. Ja rozmovlyayu. Ja dumayu. Meaning I think. Ja dumayu. Ja mayu. Meaning I have. Ja mayu. Ja znayu. Meaning I know. Ja znayu. As you have noticed here, the ending of the pronoun I in the verb is you. The next one will be conjugation of familiar you. The. The ending here will be yes. Yes. Let's check the verbs on their conjugation. Tiznayesh. You know. Ти знаєш. Ти розмовляєш. Ти розмовляєш. Meaning you talk. Ти розмовляєш. Ти маєш. Meaning you have. Ти маєш. Ти думаєш. Meaning you think. Ти думаєш. Now, let's make several practical examples, several practical sam samples in sentences out of these conjugations and the new words I introduced here. Ja znaju anglijsku mogu. I know English language. Ja znaju anglijsku mogu. Ty znaješ ukrajinsku mogu. You know Ukrainian language. Ty znaješ ukrajinsku mogu. Ty dumaješ, що ja тут. You think that I'm here. Ти думаєш, що я тут. Ти маєш будинок. You have a house. Ти маєш будинок. Я трохи розмовляю українською мовою. I speak Ukrainian just a little. Я трохи розмовляю українською мовою. Ти розмовляєш англійською мовою. Do you speak English? Ти розмовляєш англійською мовою. After these examples, try to make the examples on your own. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to let me know.